The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. If you're asked to factor this problem, you'll soon realize that there is no greatest common factor for all four of these terms and it's not set up as a trinomial that can be factored as the product of two binomials. So we need to figure out a new way of factoring this problem. The way you do it is by grouping terms together. If we group the first two terms together, x cubed minus 2x squared, and the last two terms together, positive 4x minus 8, we can factor out a greatest common factor from our first group of terms and a greatest common factor from our last group of terms. The greatest common factor for x cubed minus 2x squared is x squared. That leaves you with x minus 2 inside the parentheses. The greatest common factor for positive 4x minus 8 is positive 4. That leaves you with x minus 2 also inside the parentheses. Now we can finish it just like the last problem you were doing. Since there's an x minus 2 in each of these two terms, it factors out. So we have x minus 2 times what's left inside the parentheses, which is x squared plus 4. And that's your answer.